my favorite ways is through games and courses. Um, I find that if I ever don't understand uh, my own limiting factors or you know I'm kind of stuck in a rut in my own progression, uh, running an obstacle course can quickly show me some weaknesses of mine or playing a game of add-on with friends. Um, so I like to do it through games and courses. Yeah, it's a big one. Competitions have always revealed holes in my game. Yeah, that's a little more experiential or creative way to go about it. I think also, you know, some of the people, I, like I said, I consider myself a very kind of methodical thinker. Like, I like to break things down. And people who are like that, one model that I constantly come back to in my own training or when I'm trying to get somebody else to learn something is this, you know, think of a triangle. You've got mental, physical, and technical. Um, and then you need to identify which one of those three points of the triangle is limiting you or preventing you from learning a skill for for example if you're trying to learn a backflip but you're really scared that would be a mental limitation or if you can't even do a good tuck jump that would be a physical uh, limitation because you don't have the strength or power to lift your knees up to your chest explosively or if you're lacking some kind of you know backflip progressions learning you know how does a backflip even work that would be learning how to um, address the technical limitations that you might have so that's one little model that I like to use. Yeah, and, and I said stuff about identifying your weaknesses, but there's so much more, right? There's a, you know maybe a mobility issue or a strength issue. And, and something else I'll throw out there is something I've done is I find people who do something really well and I film them and then I film myself trying it as well and I watch both those videos in slow motion and I try to analyze what they're doing different technique wise. Um, if it's not technique, I'll usually try to do more research into whether it's a, a physical or uh, maybe a mobility, a mobility issue or a strength issue or something like that. So that's usually my um, plan when I find that I have limitations on a certain technique.